The African civet is a member of the family Viveridae, along with the mongoose. They're nocturnal mammals that are somewhat cat-like and somewhat raccoon-like, but they're actually not related to either. You know what civets love? They love to find things that give off a strong aroma and then mark these things with their own powerful scent gland, which is located near their genitals. It's their way of communicating and marking territory. Here in a Congo rainforest, this civet chances upon a giant piece of rotting fruit. As you can see, this animal is transported somewhere beyond dreamland to a land of olfactory bliss. It rubs on the fruit as it rocks and rolls with it, luxuriating in its heavenly fermenting stench. I mean, what could be better? How about something equally smelly and also alive? The civet discovers a tree pangolin. Much to the civet's delight, the toothless pangolin gives off a pungent scent when it's threatened. This is supposed to scare off the civet. Instead, the civet goes into olfactory overload and becomes a scent-marking maniac. The pangolin curls up into a defensive ball, shielded by its armor. But this only makes it easier for the civet to engage in frenzied scent marking. Finally, the civet's delirium pushes the poor pangolin downward into the water. As the civet watches helplessly, the pangolin swims away. And then climbs a branch. So no more scent-crazed civets can rub it the wrong way. <laughs>